Hey, I'm Vanessa, the girl on a bike. Welcome back to my channel. I am particularly excited right now because I'm in Romania. I'm going to be doing the Red Bull Romaniacs race and what better way to get used to the terrain than riding with Jarvis Signature Tours Romania. So this is a pretty new offering from Jarvis, the main man himself, and I'm gonna be getting out into the mountains, Carpathian Mountains, here we come, let's go. Didn't know, but what enduro school doesn't have an epic dog? This is Travis. I think he's to keep the bike safe more than anything, right? Beast. <laughs> I thought I should show you where we are staying. So this is the farmhouse. Yes, it is a farm that we are staying on. They actually do horse riding summer camps for kids as well as the motorbike side of things. So I think they've got about 18 ponies here. But they've got beautiful rooms, hot showers, comfortable beds, breakfast laid on in the bar and a pretty epic setting in the middle of the Romanian countryside. And there's Rocky Monster. Yeah, we're getting ready. It's going to be a good few days. That is the Jarvis barn. So that's where the mechanics, the bikes live, etc. Hey, Travis is coming over to check I'm not causing any trouble. Hey, Pooch. You are an absolute beast. coming up behind me. I think I might be more nervous about Romaniacs now, but this is amazing riding. The most important thing is don't lose your power. So always look for a better line, stop, turn around, look around you and find the right track to go up. The right line. Let's do this, Vanessa. Rub some Jarvis skill off. Let's go. Yeah? Second gear. Ridiculous fall going downhill. <laughs> the logs, yeah. oh, they've moved the logs, <laughs> hit them completely <laughs> wrong, <laughs> slid, spun, and uh, pammed in really hard right onto my. In Ooh, having a moment, in little cry. It's what happens with enduro, hard enduro, it happens. Thankfully, no brakes, ready to get going again. <laughs> This terrain is like unbelievable. 
possible. Um, I'm a bit shaken up from my off. It has not my confidence. We just came down this hill. Um, probably the steepest downhill wood kind of slidey oh, food hill I've ever done. Yes, pretty mild banana. We're going to share it. Um, the riding out here is just madness. Um, the guys really know where to go. Because Romaniacs is obviously here every year, there's all the different level of classes from Romaniacs around here. So whether you're a novice rider or all the way through to a gold level Romaniacs rider, there is something here to keep you entertained. Have a really, really good day. Let's keep riding. I need to shake off that accident a little bit and uh, build some confidence. But having him in, in the intercom is definitely helping, reassuring me that I'm not gonna die. Not, not right here anyway. <laughs> Stop for some lunch. Apparently this is my nut sack and you guys carry yours, but I've got mine. <laughs> ah! I can't reach the ground. What do I do? There's not even anything in front of me. Come on, Vanessa. It's not even steep. Come on. I've got a tree in my face. I don't think I can turn. No, no, I'm gonna fall off. No, I'm just freaking out because I went over the handlebars just now when I'm freaking out. Okay, I take your bike, you calm down, I'm and you order it and when you like. I'm really sorry. Okay. Um, the most difficult is the first nature. Because you don't have uh, balance. Talents. You need to miss the brake one meter, take the speed sufficient for balance, and then Turn. brake again. Okay? Damn it. You know what? I'm freaking out. I didn't enjoy. That was, that was ridiculous. I just had a total freak out on that hill. It was pretty steep and there were trees and... You did a great job. Oh, I said I did a great job. I freaked out. Going over the handlebars hasn't helped my confidence. Easy. That was actually really easy. My mind is playing with me now. Oh, dope. Oh, and the what? Nice, good job. Oh shit, you alright? Woo!
one of the slightly smaller apparently, it felt big on the ride up, Carpath Carpathian Mountain Tops. Look at that view. Transylvanian Starbucks, way better version. Here we go. Woohoo! Refilling the water bottles. Fresh water. That is the way to do it. We are back in one piece. Well, that's super close up because you were touched on my camel back. There we go. <sighs> now that was a epic day riding. Dude, seriously, I want to give you a hug. The tuition and the tips that you both have given me today. This guy, he knows how to teach and he certainly knows the Romanian terrain. Um, I think there were hill climbs that I really struggled with this morning that I was then kind of getting up this afternoon, kind of. Good progression. We've got two more days of this as well, so let's do this! But now, time for some food? I think some food. <laughs> no, camera shy. <laughs> Yay, there we go. The Romaniacs, woo! Hello. We are Adi kitting and packing up the van because basically the easiest way to get the best terrain is a short drive with the bikes and the trailer. But we've just had some really exciting news. Yeah. We are going to a pool on the way home. Ah, bikini time! <laughs> <laughs> I'm on a bouncy thing. <laughs> okay. Oh. Ooh. Oh. This place has all the fun stuff. This morning too. <laughs> We've just had a really scummy breakfast. We had pancakes, omelette, and some cereal and a really nice coffee. Um, we are gonna go out riding today, riding with Graham Jarvis as well. Which is very exciting because that is hypnotizing watching him ride. Oh, and the sun is shining. I need to lie down now. I'm not convinced bouncing on the bouncy thing was a great idea for my hip. Um, check out my story if you are wondering why I'm complaining about my hip. It's kind of reconstructed. I'll see you in a bit. Jump off the top of the sand dune, and then you just you just play and, uh, and land on the water. Yeah. Can't quite believe this, Marty, the man behind Romaniacs, Jarvis, the Romaniacs wolfhound, pinch me. <laughs> away too far this morning and um, we're staying quite local but we have the main man himself and the Romaniacs wolf pack we're gonna be doing a little bit of training and riding a bit more local to the signature base camp and then this afternoon we're gonna go up into the mountains and put a little bit a bit more into practice <laughs> Uh, 
Um, Alex is being a full goat. There's him over there on the hillside. I think he's actually in a bush, Ben. Yeah, just say hi. You've got to go higher, honey. There's a landslide all the way around there. Thank goodness for intercoms. Oh, gosh. How... Mm -hmm. Um... Oh, God. Could... Good move, good move. You're so close to that landslide, honey. Yeah! Oh! oh good. Yay! Rocky Monster will live to see another day. Just dab the brakes. Practice dabbing the brakes will leave. Because that helps compress it when you pull the brakes. Pressure, but you can use like a little hump or a rock or whatever. Wow. wow. been doing some skill training with Jarvis. Mad skill, eh? Look at that. I'll keep practicing. Wow, they are gorgeous horses. Nibble, nibble. 
We got your trust eventually, didn't we? We weren't sure at first. Oh. Too much, too much colors. <laughs> yeah, as soon as I took my helmet off. Too many colors. He knew I was human. <laughs> hello. Oh, you want to say hello to the cameraman? <laughs> He's Rocky Monster. <laughs> <laughs> Total bump into the camera. He's a big close up pony nose. You get all the experiences with signature tours, including ponies. You gonna be alright if I start my engine up? Okay, we're gonna make a noise. Okay, that's your warning. Hey, clever girl. Boy, don't know what you are. Back at the uh, at the farmhouse for some lunch after a pretty cool morning training on a really quite a small area of land, but it was precision in our riding, starting on a hill climb really slowly and feeling the tire bite into the soil, being able to stop to pull away, to reverse back down the hill out of trouble using the clutch and not the brakes to pull up those hills and then also some pivot turn and a little cheeky bit of uh, Jarvis wheelie tippage, which I haven't actually put into practice. I think I should learn wheelies on my own bike, not <laughs> risk someone else's rear end. But we're about to have some lunch and then we are gonna trailer up and head up into the mountains for a couple of hours of riding this afternoon. Lunchtime. <laughs> My mum always changes the language and she just talked to Lydia in Romanian and expected her to understand. Right, feel that traction. Try and flip your back wheel uh, lock up. That's it. Keep that back wheel rolling. along behind me all the way along. goat tracks up the mountain. Hey Rocky Monster! <laughs> that was so good! Wow! Um, just kind of rocky and technical and springy and flutly and watery and ah! Romania baby! <sighs> we are at another Starbucks watering hole. Um, it's unfortunately closed today because normally the pipe kind of gives you fresh water but it's got a bit stagnant. Thankfully we're carrying enough water for the day. Awesome riding! Push! So good! Push, 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 push! <laughs> yeah. One more, one more! Woo. We are in thick forest, pretty much picking out a route. Someone down there, scoping. This is so mad cool.
Oh, perfect. So now you have, you can add some butter if you want on top. You can have some cheese. Fantastic. Looks easy. I wouldn't trust me to do it. <laughs> you can try. The next one you try. It. You do it. Excellent. Same. Alex has been making a pancake for about an hour, so I thought I'd come check on him. How's it going? Are you actually nearly done? Yeah, I think it's, I think it's just about done. Oh, yeah. I can't really banter him for that, because that... <laughs> oh, the hiccups. That looks pretty amazing. Uh oh! <laughs> There's crazy hiccups. We're going to go for a race. You don't look like you fit in there. No? Are oh, you giving up? Okay, my turn. Clearly should have had a safety brief. There is a break. I didn't need to drive into the wall. <laughs> I think my inner two-year-old has come out on one of these. Um, but I'm gonna get off. And we're gonna go ride motorbikes. Day three with Jarvis Signature Tours Romania, who have really fun stuff here, and it's not just motorbikes. You've got dogs, go-karts, and horses, and really cool people. <laughs> Doing a bit of pre-ride hip um, support, so it's basically like a deep tissue massage thing. It looks dodgy, it's not dodgy. Helps me keep riding. I'm getting some pre-ride collagen to get some of that performance going on. The bikes are ready to go. We are kidding up. Kind of looks like a a Vanessa yard sale, but we're getting there and it is really hot. Really warm. Woo! <laughs> We've got four mini Jarvises. <laughs> we're about to go and hit the mountain. Yeah. You ready? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah. We just did like a single track, twisty, rocky, facey, slabby, ratty thing all the way up the side of the mountain. And that was, I'm just keep saying the same thing, but that was just wow. The, there is a pretty epic variation terrain here, um, but with a common theme of 
hard enduro. But I'm saying that, probably worth mentioning that Jarvis Signature Tours is designed to go from anyone from novice all the way through to your mini Jarvises. So don't worry if you're, you're not feeling like a mini Jarvis. These guys are going to have some terrain to keep you happy, comfortable, safe. Push you a little bit if you want to as well. And views like this. A great rider. Yay! <laughs> I got on video. Woo! <laughs> black. We uh, found raspberries. Yeah. Wild raspberries. Look. Here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna pick it for Rocky Monster because I already ate one, <laughs> and I'll pick one for where be? Yeah. <gasps> There's one. I'm foraging. Foraging. I won't eat all of them because I'll leave some for someone. Oh, there's loads of them. <laughs> We're in a raspberry meadow. Found some, some mountain dogs. Ooh, they're super cute and fluffy, but they don't want to be friends with me because they're scared. Hi. They're used to... Hi. I guess I speak the wrong language as well. of our Jarvis Signature Tours Romania adventure. We've done three days in the Carpathian Mountains and it has been absolutely mind-blowing. If you want enduro, whether that is from novice to freaking extreme stuff, this really is a place to go. They've got all the accommodation, they've got all the bikes of Husqvarna TE300Is and they certainly have the knowledge to know where to take you in this absolute enduro playground. Now, I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Please do hit subscribe, hit like, let me know in the comments. Now, I have a bit of a reasoning why you should come here and do three days minimum of hard enduro Romania. Now, the first day is because you'll basically realize that you're not as good as riding as, it, as you thought, particularly if it's a wet day in Romania like our day one. The terrain here really is like nothing that I've ridden before in a slightly more difficult kind of way. Day two will then start to let you build your confidence, put into practice some of the tips that the Jarvis guides are giving you. And then day three, you can finally feel like a little bit of a boss where it all starts to make sense and click. So I have been here doing some preparation for Red Bull Romaniacs, which is the next challenge on my calendar. So stay tuned. There is of course gonna be a Red Bull Romaniacs video. I'm Vanessa the Gun on a Bike. Massive thanks, but for now, I better go get this bike back. And I think we're gonna head to the pool. <laughs>